Okay, I'm going to show you a few um, things we won today. We usually save everything that comes in the mail with the prize, so I'm just going to go through a few things and show you. This was a Purina dog food win. This was from Gerber, a onesie and like a little graduation cutesy thing. This was a win from Wild Dill and I ended up buying some water bottles, some reusable water bottles, and bath toys, I believe, from that one. I think it was $50. This one was some homeschooling stuff, which now I wish I would have saved. Some workbooks. I, think I gave those to somebody locally. This was mosquito repellent. This was called a di diabetes box, and it had a lot of different products in it that you know, for people who are diabetic, we're not, but still used like the lotion and um, there was a lot of different, there was food items, there was everything in there. It was, it was pretty cool. I think about $200 worth, actually. I don't know what this was from. It was promotions, etc. Um, usually I label them, but I did not on that one, so. This was the Journey Home DVD and I believe there was a $25 or $50 Visa card with that one. This was from a really big fair trade win. Um, it was a picture contest and we won tons of things and it, it was worth so much money. I believe this was a scarf. So that was really neat. This was an instant win. Tissue containers. We actually use ours for coffee filters. some Leah Rimini socks, which I love her, so it's cool. Dish soap win around Christmas time. Sometimes I just have to write them down. This was Xbox Live Gold membership, and I think it was, um, I think we actually won about 10 of them. Or no, we won a year of it, actually, overall. It was an instant win. And then a $10 Amazon gift card. This was from a cigarette company. Um, I think it might have been Newport, which is weird because I didn't know. Virginia Slims, and it was a pedicure thing. <laughs> that was a Marlboro contest. I'm not sure. They always give away prizes. Um, it might have been a Zippo, or maybe that was Camel. I'm not sure, but there's a lot of those, and they're usually good prizes. This was a shirt, a book, sunglasses, hair things from a blog. And this was the Halloween Tree DVD. This was a Lunchable Instant Win. And it might have been Jenga. Here are a whole bunch of candy bar wins. Those are extremely easy to win. This was a another lunchable another lunchable win. And it was a trans I think this one was a transformer. Yeah. Transformer. A UPS cup, which I used forever. This was more fair trade. Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Cause, oh, that was just the overall like win. Um, this was another Journey Home DVD, and I believe again it had a gift card in it. And I don't think this was the gift card, but here's another $50 Visa card I received. Usually those are from blogs. This was a book, $29 value book um, about um, how to turn your hobby into 
a mini making business, which was cool. Um, this was um, the Crudes DVD, uh, Blu-ray, and then a little stuffed animal to go along with it. And it was, they actually sent me double of both. So I ended up with two plushes and two DVDs. Um, so I gifted one of those to somebody. This was um, a book win, I believe, yeah. And there was some other stuff that came with it, too. This was a grizzly win. Um, we do not smoke or uh, chew, but uh, we do vape. So, <laughs> But no, this is uh, usually just smaller wins, but good stuff. This was something mom won. It was a Goodreads Joe Frost toddler rule book. So the, is that the super nanny maybe? Maybe. We only enter for books that we really, really want because there's so there's so many contests or sweepstakes for them that you could never enter all of them. You have to be very selective. This was a pen. This was a reusable bag. This was, I think, children's books? Yeah, Monster Mash book set. So I think it was three, like, Halloween kind of themed books. Um, I wrote on here K-Cups. We won um, a coupon for K-Cups. And then Lollipops and Ladybugs, um, that blog, I believe that was some sort of makeup or... This is 2014, so it's a little hard to remember, but it was some kind of beauty product, I think. This was a shirt, valued at $3. This was a pair of sunglasses that I used for a while. This was some sort of a sample from Poshly, worth $2. Another uh, Marlboro prize. I'm not sure what that was either, but again, usually something kind of good. Red King Shampoo. This one I put $35 on, so whatever that was was worth $35. Oh, it's a full light. This was, I believe, a huge um, blog win of all kinds of different chapsticks and lipsticks and lip products, basically. This was a Corona t shirt. Another Corona t-shirt. We won a lot of those. This was from a really cool thermos win. That was, it was um, a thermos full of hot coffee in the mail. And then there was a coffee bag, or a bag of, uh, a bag of coffee beans. And just all kinds of different little accessories. It was really cool. This was um, a headlamp situation the kids enjoyed. This was eye makeup remover which I still use, and Crystal Rose, let's see, her, her website is ckstl.avonrepresentative.com, this was from the Thermos win, another Poshly win, and I think that was a bigger win. This was Captain Underpants, and it was the book, a t-shirt, and a $50 gift card. More from the Coffee Win Thermos. This was a Burt's Bees sample. Oh, and I should mention too, while we're on Burt's Bees, in that fair trade package, there was a huge, I mean, this thing was worth probably a thousand or more dollars, but there was a huge gift basket of um, like baby essentials so you know newborn onesies um, hats you know all that kind of stuff it was awesome I still have it waiting to find a baby to give it to um, swab ten dollars looks like it was oh lotion tanning lotion this was a peanut prize pack there was some delicious things in there 
it's another Marlboro one. And this got a little screwed up, but it was actually a like a little outdoor lamp. This was a pretty large um, dog treat win. And, well, you can tell what it looked like, but there was lots of goodies in it. A shirt, all kinds of things. This was Minion cereal, Minion toy, fruit snacks, and a Fandango gift card. And there's a lot of those on blogs to um, promote new movies and that sort of thing. Um, there was some hair care samples. This was a Purina coupon. This was a netted by the Web Webby's um, kind of like a box, and it was full of like some tech gear and stuff. It was cool. It had like a Bluetooth um, Bluetooth headphones, Bluetooth um, speaker, all kinds of stuff. These were nail decals, and to be really honest, they were super cheap and not great, so I actually had to throw those away, unfortunately. This was an L&M win, and it, I believe, was a $50 gift card. Or a $50 Vista card. This was from a blog, and it was actually lice, um, to prevent lice. It was a hair products, that whole line. Um, they didn't work real well, but we did use them on the kids' hair, so even though they didn't have lice. And they never got them, so I guess they worked. <laughs> um, this was uh, an Applegate win. There was tons of stuff. There was like, um, they're kind of like Lunchables, and there was there was three of them, and my kids loved them. And there was like some reusable bags and all kinds of goodies. This was a couple of spoons, like cereal brand spoons. Another Poshley giveaway for one. More Purina. This was an interesting uh, soccer jersey type situation. I still have it, don't know what to do with it. I know it's worth something, so I don't want to just throw it away or give it away, but I don't know uh, who would want it. I don't know people like that, so. Let's see. This was a t shirt that my son got to design himself, which was cool. This was from Boys Rule the World, and it was from uh, a gift card from Stride Right. Another Corona t-shirt. Another Marlboro prize, probably a Zippo. I'm not sure what this was for. This was a Skull win. I believe that was another lighter, but it was a different brand. This was a Kahiki, um, it's from a uh, blog, and it was a, a few coupons for this brand food, and then like frozen food packages, and then also a really nice big, nice big pan. I can't think of what they're called, but I will insert it. I'm drawing a blank right now. This was for a uh, insulated wine situation. Um, Hasbro figure in your iTunes gift code. And this was a Lou Ferrigno sticker. Okay, we're going to go through some more of our wins. This was a Purina win. This was an iTunes gift card. Instant win. This was a $6 Subway gift card. This was a Pepsi coupon. And this was a pair of underwear. This was a box of makeup, Avon makeup. This was Glee Gum, but it was also a chocolate kit um, with real cocoa beans and it was really awesome. We actually ended up winning another one of those in our fair trade box too. <laughs> 
studio. Um, we want some of that. That's all of these. Every single type. It was delicious. Super good quality. This was a knife. And this was six packages of diapers. Bamboo brand. This was a really odd win from a blog. It was a rolly vertical grill. And if you want to make phallic looking food, then get a rolly. And these people, this is, I hate this kind of thing because, you know, it's really awesome to win this. Um, I believe it was, a, yeah, it was a book and a DVD. Um, my kids liked it, but the person who I won it from continued to harass me about writing a review. And at the time, I was actually having my third child, and it was not possible to do that. And she ended up getting a little angry with me. And, uh, yeah, so not one of my favorite wins. This was a Maleficent prize pack, t-shirt poster, horns, and that was from the blog Queer Me Up. This was an Oshkosh win, and there was a lot of clothes in there, and then, um, yeah, that's cool. This was a Jergens. Um, a Jergens win, I guess. Yeah. And then it had nail polish, eyeshadow, tote bag worth $85. If you're like an OG uh, sweepstakes person, you know exactly what this is. Stoner. And that is not actually uh, what it's about, but <laughs> um, a t shirt from them, so. Um, a hat and then a check for, I think it was, yeah, $5 check and a racing kit. This was a coupon for milk that was never used. This was in, I believe, the first season of Scandal from Anderson Live, who I know. This was a whole of dog products and this is from a blue box thing I believe some band-aids useful win this was a autograph plankton thing that my kids won this says the wrong name on it but I did win it it's very weird um, but it was a PS4 game that I ended up giving to my oldest son's dad because we do not have a PS4. Um, this was a creator box which was really fun. Oh wait, that was a creator box and my son really liked that, my oldest son. This was a blog win of some sort. Deal sharing ant, not sure what it was. I think these were prints uh, for the wall. There's tons more stuff in here. There's makeup, um, worth 107. I don't know, other goodies. These are some of the wins from 2014 that we ended up either tossing or misplacing the the papers that came with them. So we don't have, you know. Added up a total on there. This was stuff that we won when we first started that we, we just kind of remembered. Um, or some good stuff in 2006. And then this is some of my mom's stuff. Looks like 2013, 2014.
Ja.